Hey guys, welcome to my video. For today's tutorial, I will be teaching you how to make the open wave stitch. To begin, all you're going to need is some yarn and a crochet hook. For this tutorial, you will need to know how to make chains, how to make the single crochet stitch, the half double crochet stitch, the double crochet stitch, the triple crochet stitch, and how to work in the back loops. I have videos on all of those and I will have them listed down below. Starting from the very beginning, making chains, you're going to make chains in the multiple of 16 plus 2. I have already made 34 chains on my hook. To start row 1, make one single crochet into the second chain from your hook. You're then going to make one single crochet into each chain across. So that's one single crochet into the second chain from your hook and then one single crochet into each chain across for row one. To start row two, make one chain. Into the first stitch of your row, make one single crochet. Into the next stitch, make one single crochet. Chain one, skip one stitch. Into this next stitch, make a half double crochet. Chain one, skip one stitch, into this next stitch, make a double crochet. Chain one, skip one, into the next stitch, make a triple crochet. Chain one, skip one, into this next stitch, make a triple crochet. Chain one, skip one, into this next stitch, make a double crochet. Chain one, skip one, into this next stitch, make a half double crochet. Chain one, skip one. Into the next three stitches, you're gonna make one single crochet into each. So that's one, two, and three. We can now see how our sequence is going to go. At the beginning of our row and the end of our row, we're gonna have two single crochet. But after our single crochet, chain one, skip one, half double, chain one, skip one, double, chain one, skip one, triple, chain one, skip one, triple, chain one, skip one, double, chain one, skip one, half, chain one, skip one, single crochets. So we're now going to start repeating this sequence after our single crochets. Chain one, skip one, half double. Chain one, skip one, double. Chain one, skip one, triple. Chain one, skip one, triple again. Chain one, skip one, double. Chain one, skip one, half double. Chain one, skip one. We're at the end of our row, you're skipping this stitch, so you're going to have two stitches left, and you're going to make one single crochet into each of those stitches to complete this row. And that's how row two is looking. To start row three, make one chain. We're going to work one single crochet into each stitch and open space across. And that's how row three is looking. 
To start row four, make one chain. Similar to our last row, we're going to be working one single crochet into each stitch, but we're only going to be using the back loop of each stitch. So to identify the back loop, turn your work to the top where you could see the top of these stitches, the loop farthest away from you. So this one right here is going to be the back loop of each stitch. So you're simply going to make one single crochet into each stitch only using that back loop. And that's how row four is looking. To start row five, make five chains. Into the first stitch of your row, make one triple crochet. Chain one, skip one. Into the next stitch, make a double crochet. Chain one, skip one. Into the next stitch, make a half double crochet. Chain one, skip one. Into the next three stitches, make one single crochet into each. So that's one, two, and three. Chain one, skip one. Into this next stitch, make a half double crochet. Chain one, skip one. Into this next stitch, make a double crochet. Chain one, skip one. Into this next stitch, make a triple crochet. Chain one, skip one. Into this next stitch, make a triple crochet. Chain one, skip one. Into this next stitch, make a double crochet. Chain one, skip one. Into this next stitch, make a half double crochet. Chain one, skip one. Into the next three stitches, make one single crochet into each. So that's one, two, and three. Chain one, skip one. Into this next stitch, make a half double crochet. Chain one, skip one. Into this next stitch, make a double crochet. Chain one, skip one. Into this next stitch, make a triple crochet. Chain one, skip one. Into the last stitch of your row, make a triple crochet. Chain one, and that's how row five is looking. To start row six, make one chain. You're going to make one single crochet into each stitch and open space across. And that's how row six is looking. To start row seven, make one chain. We're going to be making one single crochet into each stitch across again, but only using those back loops. So looking at the top of your work, identifying the back loop as this loop, the one that's farthest away from you on each stitch, you're simply gonna make one single crochet into each stitch only using that back loop. And that's how row seven is looking. You would now repeat rows two through seven for however long you want your project. 
and that is going to be how to make the open wave stitch. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please like and subscribe for more from me. You can follow me on all social media at Crochet Me Lovely, all one word. Please leave me any feedback down below for future videos and tutorials that you would like to see. Thank you guys so much for being here and have a great day.